Good morning, Chargers. It's Samara and Manit. Bring you your daily, daily news for today. today. In today's show, we will be covering Heritage Week, clubs, and sports. Let's get right into it. Oh, and speaking of Heritage Assembly, we can't wait to see your performance, Manit. I'm not too a Jude, but we have lots of talented performances going on this week. Yesterday, the guitar club band Free Drinks, consisting of Rafa, John, and Brody, put on a special performance representing the Americas. They performed cultural American songs such as Purple Haze and Johnny B. Good. Well, if you missed out on yesterday's Heritage Week activity, be sure to head to the atrium to get your henna done today during lunch. Moving forward, we have many Spirit Week activities coming up. Let's take it to Mrs. Rawson to hear more about what we can expect for the coming week. So with Spirit Week coming up with the pep rally and the basketball game and the tailgate, what could we be looking forward to? Um, well, of course, we have our Spirit Week and um, this, our SGA plans that um, the May before, so last May we all got together to plan out what our days are going to be and um, we really want the student body to get involved because we really think that these are some fun games or fun days. But also our main thing for uh, Rebound Week is our three on three basketball game. So we we're going to invite all of our student body to come to the gym during lunch to watch our teams compete. Um, we have about 24 teams that are going to be competing for the championship medals. Um, and that will start Wednesday of next week, um, a week prior to Rebound Week. And then, of course, the tailgate, which is always fun. And then we have that great basketball game uh, versus Palm Beach Lakes, which is always our, it's our um, you know, county rival. So it's mm -hmm. always a good game to come out and see. Right. So you guys heard it here first. Everybody show out next week and watch the games, have fun, and I'll see you next time. Seniors, don't forget to check your email to find out information about cap and gown portraits, which will be taken on January 24th. Seniors will also be taking the senior group photo picture during fifth block, so be sure to dress to impress. Now, let's get into sports. The freshman basketball team did nothing but score buckets after buckets in their amazing victory against Gardens this week. The game was fought very hard with our Chargers fighting to keep their lead, and one of their players shared what made the experience good for him. It was, it was a decent game. We could have done better, you know, on offense, on defense. I feel like we did better overall when we did, when we was working on our teamwork, you know, just passing that ball around, making sure everyone got their looks in. The final score was 55 to 33, and our Chargers did an amazing job this night. <laughs> Reporting for WRSN, this has been Alan. Wish our Chargers a very happy birthday. Happy birthday, Chargers. That's all for today. It's been Monet and Samara. Thanks, Thanks for, for tuning, tuning in. in.